Good afternoon. What's going on, everybody? How's it going? I'm Miles. Welcome back to the channel. Today, I am back on another reaction video, and this is the third and final stop on our journey through the trilogy of songs from Falling in Reverse. This song being the song Drugs. Now, it seems like from the last video, a lot of people weren't very happy about how I uh, put out the final version of the reaction video because I uh, fast forwarded through most of the song. And I mean, I, I don't know. I literally was trying to avoid getting copyright claims because um, unlike what I've been told by a number of people in the comments, in actuality, I did get copyright claimed on the last videos that I made. Hi everyone, so Editor Miles here. I just wanted to share something with the people that were leaving me comments saying that Ronnie, Volume Reverse, and Epitaph wouldn't do copyright claims on videos of their songs from their artists or whatever. And I just wanted to show you what I have on my YouTube channel in regards to that. So right here is the first video that I did on Falling in Reverse, that first reaction video. And not only did it get copyright claimed, but it also got partially blocked, which I know that isn't necessarily because of me, but that's still a thing that exists on my video. And not just that video, but even the video of Ronnie reacting to my reaction video got copyright claimed and partially blocked. Now, obviously the same thing happened with the song from Trap, but you know, they could take whatever money they can get. I, I feel for them, they're not good at anything else, they need my help, so fine. But this other video for Falling in Reverse, partially blocked, copyright claimed. However, most recent video of Losing My Life, nothing. And that's because the way that the system works is that it picks up familiar attributes of songs from different artists that that information has been put in in its database. And after it finds something familiar, it really investigates to see and confirm that it's a song and that's how you get copyright claimed. You can dispute it, but odds are it's not going to make any difference for you as a YouTuber. But, you know, it, it is what it is. My channel's not monetized, so it's not like I'm missing out on money. I just don't want it to be a situation where I have so many videos that are getting copyright claimed that YouTube decides that I'm a liability to them and they delete my channel. So there you go. That's how it works. That's what happened. And here we are. Okay, back to the episode. But that's neither here nor there. Anyway, let's, um, let's just dive on in. Let's just see what this song is about. So this is Falling in Reverse, Drugs. So already right off the bat, this is the most I've seen the band move out of the three videos. Like, aside from Popular Monster, in the other two videos that I've seen so far, the band is like standing very awkwardly and look almost like the uh, the Tin Man from The Wizard of Oz um, when he needs oil. So, glad they finally woke up. Such an uncomfortable feeling beginning to feel the hostility for my ability of slowly becoming a villain. I just want to thank all my fans, especially without you is a death to me. I don't consider myself a celebrity, but I've been doing this shit since I'm 70. This is my destiny. This is the best of me. It's an incredible feeling. The other thing I noticed, it seems like this video out of the three, I'd say, has the most detail as far as production. Um, 
I don't know too much about visual production stuff, but it seems like a lot of these sort of like hand-drawn stuff that's thrown in here, like the X's over his eyes, the nooses, the outlines of the in instruments and whatnot, that takes a long time to do all that stuff and animate it really well. So that doesn't look like it's just like a layer on top of everything. Like it's almost inside the video itself. But um, yeah, no, it looks really good. Plus this whole back and forth thing. It reminds me of the video from Bring Me the Horizon for uh, Sep Eternal. I believe that's the name of the song. Um, but it's like a constant back and forth thing that's going on in that video too. And uh, yeah, no, it's cool. I like it. So, just to comment on it, um, I didn't know that Corey Taylor was in this song, in the video, and uh, that was great. That whole breakdown section in general, I, I think it's really strong. And his voice, I mean, pretty much anything that Corey Taylor is screaming on, I'm, I'm all about. So, cool. I dig it. be fucking kidding me! Yeah, 
overall, I think the song uh, is pretty good. I feel like it's nothing too noteworthy, in my opinion. I feel like the song is very sort of generic sounding. There's nothing that stands out really aside from the bridge. And in my opinion, the part with Corey Taylor is probably the best part of the whole song. But, I mean, that's just my opinion. I feel like visually and in terms of like the different scenes within the uh, within the video, in terms of the dialogue and whatever, like the scene where he's speaking to his mother, that character, he's giving like a very sort of like self-empowerment speech about like how he doesn't need her anymore and he's got himself and blah, blah, blah. But then it's followed by him hanging from a noose. So I don't know, I can see that as being kind of confusing, kind of a mixed message there, but whatever. Um, overall, even with the chorus being a bit wordy, in my opinion, it's, it, it succeeds as a chorus. And yeah, song does what it's supposed to do. I dig it. I like it. And uh, yeah, hopefully you guys like what I had to say. And thank you for sticking with me throughout this whole process. And if you like what I have to say here, you like what I'm doing here, and you haven't already, hit the subscribe button. If you like the video, hit the like button. If you don't like the video, hit the dislike button. Do whatever you want. If you hate me, leave a comment about it in the comment section. <laughs> Um, yeah, that's all I got on this, and, uh, I'll see you guys in the next one, alright? Peace.